Hi and welcome. My mission is to enable students to love and enjoy maths by making math simple for them to understand. So these videos are very detailed for the purpose of helping them understand rather than simply memorizing the concepts. I'm Benjamin, author of 18 math guidebooks found in all major bookshops and personal tutor to more than 2,500 students over the last 20 years. Remember to subscribe for more of my teaching and student motivation videos. For a printable copy of this question, please join my Telegram group found in the description below. Let's start to really understand maths. The method that will be used here is the simple replacement method that is suitable for primary 5 or 11 year olds. Okay, so here, the first thing we need to do, as always, is to know which are the keywords. So the keywords go like this. Three chickens, as much as two ducks, six chickens, five ducks, 18.9 kilograms. And the question is the mass of a duck. So the first thing we want to do is to draw a model to represent three chickens. So we simply draw three rectangles like this. We break this into three portions and each box here would represent one chicken. Next, since three chickens weigh as much as two ducks, then they are equal. So if they are equal, then I will be able to pull this model down and draw a model made up of two boxes, since it represents two ducks. So this would be the two ducks. Okay, each box here represents one duck. Now, if we continue reading, it says that there are six chickens and five ducks. This means that I should add how many more chickens behind the first tree? What do you think? You can pause this video, video at any time if you want to stop it and think about it, okay? So the answer here should be that there should be three more chickens, okay? Since there are six chickens as asked by the question. So right now, I'm going to draw three more boxes to represent a total of six chickens, okay? So this would be chicken, 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 and lots of chickens, okay? Now, if these three chickens are equivalent to two ducks, then in the same way, these three chickens should be equal to two more ducks. And I'm going to add two more boxes below to represent the two more ducks. And right now I have a total of four ducks, okay? Behind this model, I should be adding five more ducks according to the question. And we do not need to actually draw five ducks there, but simply to add a box and represent it as if it was five ducks. So let's just say five, Ducks, D, D for ducks. And we will carry that same model down to bring it down over here. So these two models here and here, they represent the same total, okay? So if they represent the same total, then it means that Six chickens and five ducks have the same value as how many ducks? Can you tell me the answer? Your answer should be nine ducks. If you did that, well done. And 
since they say that six chickens and five ducks weigh 18.9 kilograms, then let's put it in here and in here. And with this, we will be able to find the mass of one duck. So if nine ducks is 18.9, then one duck would be 18.9 divided by nine. And that should give me 2.1 kilograms, okay? So if one duck is 2.1 kilograms, and the question is, what is the mass of a duck? I have already answered the question. So the answer for this question is, each duck weighs 2.1 kilograms. Okay, let me just put that down. Each duck weighs or has a mass of, let's follow the question, 2.1 kilograms. And that is how you use the replacement method to convert chickens into ducks. Were the explanations clear and useful for you? Let me know by leaving your questions in the comments below. Remember to subscribe for more teaching and student motivation videos. And if you are serious about your child's future, call or WhatsApp me at the number found in the description below to help your child score and excel while studying less. I'll see you again.